done and we're at the Gable Creek campground. It's a nice night, no problems. Cool scenery, this, even from the campsite. Some of the other campers said that there's a cool ranger cabin and cool view up here. We'll check it out real quick before breakfast. This is probably our water source down below, right? And when we leave later on, we'll be going to Elizabeth Lake Foot. So it's only three and a half miles, not bad. There's the sun. Okay, we're finally leaving day two. Heading up to Elizabeth Lake from Gable Creek Campground. A little bit more sun than this morning. And the troops are ready to go. Woohoo! Ready? Let's do it. How was it? it was, um, more than yeah, the Whitehorn for sure. Definitely. Okay. Getting closer. 1.7 miles. Giddy up. So that means we've just gone just about halfway. We're halfway.
Scott to Elizabeth Lake Foot Campground. Pretty cool. They got bear lockers instead of the poles, so Shane doesn't have to do any fancy work on getting the rope over the pole. <laughs> and we're gonna go down and check out the lake. Look at that. Tomorrow when we leave out, hopefully the trail will be open. We'll be doing Ptarmigan Tunnel Trail all the way to Mendy Glacier. Wow, so you just take this trail around, there's a camp place back there. Hey? Almost lunch, and what are we gonna have? Yay! Well, we are at Elizabeth Lake Campground, and we're all set up in record time. Lunch is done. Getting ready to go to the lake. There's Shane's. Behind. Yeah. <laughs> Intent? Hey Shane, look. Huh? Hi. Hi. <laughs> How are you? Good. <laughs> and the lake is over there. Going in, going under. <laughs> How was it? <laughs> it was good, it was refreshing. We're heading now, uh, going out to the head of Elizabeth Lake. Shane's gonna try to fish a little bit. The wind was blowing a little bit too much to do fly fishing, so let's see how the wind is at the other end of the lake. Hey, first fish. Nice. 